Hey guys, this is Jamie with the Gootsie Project. I have um, a stack full of stickers and a planner that needs filling in, so I decided that I would uh, start at the camera and you guys could do it with me. So I am going to kind of hop in and get started. This was last week's spread. Pull off my little mark here. I'm using the blue watercolor, sapphire watercolor set in my in my shop with a couple other pieces in there. Um, loved it. So this week, got some stuff already in here that I'm gonna need to do. And um, so just kind of show you what we're working with today. Got some pretty washi. Not sure if this will get used or not. Let's see if they can focus. Focus, focus, maybe not, maybe it's just two, maybe, okay. Got palette knife, thanks to Miss Cindy Gunterbalda. Um, I love this thing. Got the new rose and glitter set that just came out in my shop. And I thought this would be fun to work with. This is not all the pieces to it because I am not a no white space planner. And so I don't need all the pieces in any given week. So we're going to work with this one. And then got the Erin Condren sticker book edition three. And I'm thinking I'm going to use one of these for the thankful thoughts. Um, not 100% sure yet, so we'll see how that goes. And a stack of stickers from other shops that I love or that came out in the Go Wild swag. So, and so a little bit of Chrissy and Design in there. Um, some MacLow Design. She was a Go Wild EBGB eh, sticker monster. So, a bunch of different different ones in here that we'll see what we get it used out of. But anyway, let's go ahead and get started. Um, I used the little sidebar full sticker to-do list thing that um, Aaron Condra just came out with to kind of write down a bunch of the stuff that I need to get done this week. So I'm go ahead and pull that off for the moment, we'll put it over here. We'll put it over here on the sticker book, out of frame. Um, and I've got some house people coming on Wednesday to work on some different things and gotta pay some state taxes. How fun. Okay, so um, I'm going to start with this sheet because um, it has kind of all the foundational pieces on it and uh, that will get my my um, stuff at least started. So let's close up half the book because it's so much easier to do that way. And get the washi down first. So anyway, um, kind of excited this week. Uh, just found out yesterday. Oh, I found a little bit earlier than yesterday, but it was just announced yesterday that I will be speaking at the upcoming Dallas Fort Worth DFW uh, planner meetup for the Go Wild group um, in, on one of the shop owner panels. So that sounds like it's going to be a ton of fun. I'm looking forward to that, and that's coming up in um, mid-August, I think the 18th or 19th. Um, I just announced it, but they haven't started uh, selling tickets as of today, so still waiting to get that information, but it's going to be an all-day Saturday event, and there's going to be um, multiple speakers. Amanda Sanderson Hooper is going to talk. Um, Cindy Gunterbaldo is going to be giving a Llama Loves lettering lesson. And um, like I said, there's going to be the shop panel with a, a bunch of 
local shops to the DFW area. Um, Aaron Day with Small Town Grace. And um, oh my gosh, I am completely blanking. I'll, I'll add the list in here. Um, so we're gonna all be talking. It'll be a great time. It's always fun when we all get together and, and talk about planning. We rarely do actual planning at any of these get-togethers. It's more just talking and, and enjoying enjoying the company of everybody. Ooh, that's, that's hella crooked. Let's try that one again. I like how this one ended up coming out where the rose is where the circle's at, so it kind of fit just in there. Okay, last eight cover here. And then kind of put down the to-do lists. These are my sketched flags that I use. Oh, wait, duh, Jamie. Let's start with the actual to-do words. I'm really, I, I like to stick stickers on myself while I'm holding off while I realize that I did something backwards. Um, so as I was saying that those are my sketched flags that I do. I like to have the flexibility of making them one checklist or 10 checklists depending on on uh, how busy that particular day is. I can put that one down now. And so basically all I do with that went crooked. Um, all I do is I draw a little box in and make my own little check mark on them, depending on how many, how many things need to get done in that day. And that works really nicely for me. And get all these babies down. Then go ahead and put the checklist on before flipping the flipping the screen. The screen. The book. Yeah, you can see it. Tell that I'm a pro at this. Let's see. Stickers are just so much fun. You know, I feel very lucky to be able to do something that I that I really enjoy doing in designing stickers and and um, doing a lot of custom work for people, at which which is lots of fun. Okay, so there we go. We can flip the book. Actually, before we flip it, I'm gonna go ahead and throw the weekend banner on. I always put the weekend banner right about there. I don't know exactly why. I just like the way it looks that way. Most of my layouts look just about the same because I've got a pattern that, that works for me. Like I said, I'm not a white space planner. So let's see, that should fit right about there. And usually my weekend to-dos are much less, so I'm not, not too worried about taking up some of that space. And we'll finish off the to-dos on this side. Grab a bunch. Do this one here. So normally when I plan, my Mondays are overly packed and extra ambitious. That's when I come off of a weekend with all sorts of expectations of things I'm going to get done that slowly trickle through the week. So my Monday stuff is usually rather busy. So what I end up doing is I put it on my sidebar to do because I know there's no way that it'll actually get done all on Monday, but it's, it's the day that, that there's the extra ambition. So I try to get as much of it as I can done Monday before the week starts taking over, taking over my life. So we kind of got the framework, all the little fundamentals down. 
that I like to do. Um, so here's kind of where I either use the little washi strips that I include or um, the pretty washi that I mentioned earlier. So let's see. I think that I'm going to do a little bit of this washi first. Um, the other thing that I use this washi for is, if you'll see, I give you um, some word prompts. This is so that you can combine them with the washi and, and um, make your own own little um, header without um, me telling you what it has to be. So let's use this. This will be pretty in here. Just to cover up a little bit of this blue, because it's not quite the same color scheme that I've got everywhere else. So let's see what the easiest way to do this would be. Lay down. And I used to use a credit card. I can't tell if that's if that's right or not. Yeah. I used to use a credit card to do this until I saw Cindy and she is a genius with this thing. And everything always comes up really nicely straight. Ta-da! And that matches kind of the, some of the greens in this a little better than the blue did. Stick that right there. Okay, so I'll probably end up doing something down here. A lot of times what I'll do is I'll just layer in a half box or or one of my elements over, over that in order to um, cover that up. So let's get the side done. And let's see, what do we need for the side? We need the weekly habit. I'm sorry, I use that for my dinners. We need that. We need the this week sign, the habit tracker. So let's see. Got all this stuff. Okay, so I think I need to decide on what I'm going to come up here in this little box. I'm thinking it's going to be this Hello Lovely because I really like the colors and I think it kind of mixes in here. So I think that's the one it's going to be. Just got to make a decision and go with it. Let's see here. And just know. Oh, yuck. Okay, so I overshot the box. <laughs> yep, that's okay. We will just take the this week, ta-da, and bump it right up against that spot. This is another one of my doodle stickers that I did the flags for. I'll probably be doing some stuff for Bujo's um, soon because I also in addition to this use a Bujo and sometimes I get tired of writing the monthly and the daily daily flags over and over again so there we go okay so that kind of is there and let's this is where I write down um, my ambitious to-do list and I've got it here so I'm just going to kind of Copy it over here really quick. So I, I did a video last week that I need to get edited and uploaded. So we'll get that there. Um, we're filming right now, so I'm not even going to put that one on here. I'm working on a line of keto stickers. Um, I have just started myself on the keto diet, and I'm giving it a try. So. Of course, I need some stickers. If you look in my shop, 95% of what you see in my shop is stickers that I like and I want to use. So they end up in my shop. Um, grab bags, another thing I've not done here. I'm going to zoom in a little bit closer, see if that helps any. I'll go here. Um, grab bags is something that I've never done before, but I do have a nice thick stack of stickers that are just just barely not good enough for me to sell. And so instead of throwing them away, somebody else can get a chance to see what the paper feels like, by the way, lovely butter, um, and uh, get a chance to see what it looks feels like and, and uh, sample what I've got available. So I'm gonna put those out probably this week. 
that's trying to get them on the list. Um, I've got some other, there's some other stickers that I need to work on. Um, I've got some fitness tracking monthly stickers that I need to finish out some more months on. I've only got it going through September right now, so I need to get at least through December finished. And if you're part of my Facebook group, we are doing monthly challenges. And um, right now we're in the middle of a challenge for July, which is a reading challenge. Um, so it's a lot of fun. We, we post, we talk, and um, at the end of the month, uh, somebody gets a prize for winning the challenge. So I am working on prepping for the August challenge um, because the other thing that happens is that um, I do a free printable for, for the challenge of that month. So I gotta get those stickers designed and ready and, and uh, available so that um, anybody who wants to join in and wants to print out their own stickers can do that and we can have uh, fun together. Um, I need to set up a hair appointment. Oh my God, my hair is getting so long and um, it needs to be managed. I'm in the Dallas area and it gets hot. So I have long hair that just, it needs to be taken care of. Um, so that's the big things. I've got some calls. Let's see, I need to write a letter. Write a letter. And then I've got some calls to make, and I know that I have ha ha two call things. So I'm gonna use one of these and break this up here and add the to call. Right here, to call. I need to call Cigna Vantage. I think that's it for now. So call Cigna and Vantage. Okay, so that's actually, that's most of my list. I'm gonna sprinkle some of these in throughout. Um, now let's get in the weekly dinner sticker. I'm just gonna put that right there. I try to get most of my dinners figured out ahead of time. Um, I know tonight we're having cheeseburgers. And I've got all the stuff for the other nights. I just haven't decided which night is what. So there we go with that. And then, um, so this is Monday uh, as I'm filming this. So there's where we're at right now. I need to, um, Let's see. So I'm going to go ahead and repeat that, edit the video. So I know that that's happening. Um, big stuff, that's kind of what I use down here. And I think that I'm going to do laundry tomorrow. So I'll put that one down tomorrow. I got um, a grocery delivery today. So that's good. Let's see. I want to kind of cover this one up. And since I'm not using a half box here, we'll use another one of these. Go like that. And we got a head Tom Thumb. And they came at 1 p.m. Okay, so got all the food here that I needed, which is awesome. Okay, move, let's see what we got for Tuesday. I think I'm gonna go ahead and do the laundry tomorrow, at least get, get a good portion of it done. So let me get one of those half boxes that I was talking about. Oh, here we are. So grab a, a half box and throw that on right there. And this pretty green washing machine.
there we go. I am not the most beautiful on the handwriting scale, so bear with me. Okay, so I know that on Wednesday I've got all these people coming, so I am going to do another box. I've got these half box with the flag that I like, and I use them whenever I've kind of got a, a list that goes together. So hiding the thing, and we're going to put a little house on here. And we'll put that right there, and we'll just say house. And I've got the plumbers coming. I've got a little bit of a drip. And electrician coming to give us a quote on something. And we had some stuff fixed with our doors, but it's not quite right. So the door guy is coming. I just put a little things there so I can get rid of that post-it. Um, I'll fill in these to-dos as the week goes on. But this is what I know is going on so far in this part of the week. Heading over. Ugh. State taxes. I am definitely not looking forward to taking care of those. But they're due on Thursday. And if I'm a good person and I responsible adult. I'll probably work on them Wednesday. If I'm not, <laughs> then they'll be done on Thursday. So we'll, we'll see what happens. Okay, put a little more of this down. There we go. That's pretty. Okay, so I really need like a grumpy something there because it's grumpy. But I've got um, this don't forget sticker from um, Paper Loving Mommy that I think kind of matches the colors of it. So although it's pretty and not ugly like the thought that I have about <laughs> paying the taxes, we'll do that. Okay, so. We'll just date. Taxes. <sighs> yeah, yuck. Okay. So, take that and throw that one away. Other things that I need to do this Saturday, I am going to meet with a couple girls. Shout out to Stephanie and Leslie. We're going to get together and um, have dinner, just kind of a ladies day. They're gonna, or ladies night. They're going to be doing some, some work with, with um, going through craft stuff. So I'm gonna meet them after they're done. And let's see, what one do we want to use for that? Oh, hold on. Beautiful stuff by Gabriella and Inez Designs. Um, I love, she uses the same paper as I do. I love what she's got here. So we're gonna use this little girl for payday, which is Friday. We'll go ahead and get that on there. Payday. Those are always nice days. Uh, let's see. So I've got a couple options. I've got um, Ladies Night from Chrissy Ann and um, Let's Party and Llama Sisters. I think I'm gonna use a couple of them. We'll use Llama Sisters. This is the same, this is from Maclow Designs. This is one of the um, Go Wild giveaways or swag. Um, so I'm gonna use the Llama Sisters right here. Put that right there. And I'm probably gonna double down and put um, a Let's Party sticker with it. And then um, I need to have something, I don't have a time yet, but I'm gonna put something in just to denote the time when we do end up going. Let's see, what do we wanna do? Oh, oh, I know, we'll use one of these. 
So got a couple um, quarter boxes. We'll put that one down there. That's fun. We usually do the movies on Sundays, but I'm not sure if there's anything coming out this weekend that I want to see. Um, I still got to check things out, see if I want to go see the mini maybe if Minions are still playing. I'll go see that. Um, otherwise, not sure yet what what's going to happen. Uh, let's see. I think that's just about everything. Let's see if there's anything in these pretty stickers that I want to throw in there. Oh, oh my gosh, I completely forgot. Like I said, we have a reading challenge going on, so I need to make sure that I get these in there um, for how many pages were read and what we're currently reading. So let's see, did I leave enough space for the currently reading sticker? I may have overshot myself here. Let's see, it may just barely, maybe, no. Okay, it's just gonna have to go right here. And right now I'm reading a book called North Haven. The girls in my group have been so awesome. They are just burning through books. And it's amazing the number they're reading. Um, mine has been going a little slower than theirs, but uh, they're doing awesome. I, I'm so, so happy to see what they're what they're accomplishing and making sure they get that little bit of me time in and that's the point of the the challenge is to make sure that you're focused spending a little time focusing on yourself so we'll get all these in and i love that these colors are matching <coughs> excuse me they are matching so well so we'll get all these in really quick here do a quick search after that see if there's anything else that I missed okay so my read I'm a little bit anal and the fact that I forgot this and, it, and there's another sticker already there definitely throws me off and I'm okay, I'm gonna go for trying to I need to get some of that undo stuff let's see if we can get this up the sticker paper I use usually will come up if it hasn't been sitting too long. Hey, no residue or anything. So we'll move that one up to there. And yay, that worked out awesome. Okay, there we go. And one more read. I'm gonna fill in at least what this is. So this is gonna be Stephanie. And Leslie. Okay, I think I've got everything. Remember there was something else that I wanted to make sure I got on from here. Oh yes, okay. These are very cute crock pots and I think this green goes well. And I think we're gonna do a crock pot dinner on Tuesday night. So we'll just get this down here pot roast because I think that is what we're going to do there we go since I've already got it there we'll put it here pot roast so that is kind of where we're at I will um, come back next week and give you a overview of how all this ended up working out once it got all filled in um otherwise that is it for now please let me know if you enjoyed the video if you want me to do more um if there's anything else you want to be uh want to be looking at seeing um i am open to, su to suggestions um please like the video and subscribe if you if you enjoyed it um, one of the ones that I have upcoming is an overview of the Emily Lay Daily um, Planner, which I'm going to try out starting in August, I believe is when it starts. So um, that one will be coming up soon. Um, I think that's about it. 
Thanks guys, have a good day. Bye.